What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, The Last of Us, episode number two. And we are coming off of an absolutely fantastic, amazing, emotional, emotional. very well done yeah. first episode of this game adaptation. And I think it's done a perfect job because for those who have played the game, and I've seen a lot of comments, I've heard a lot of commentary from people. Yeah. It did an amazing job. It gave us something new. Yes. It changed some stuff. Mm -hmm. And it it hit on a lot of the things that the game did. Yeah. And for those who hadn't seen, because we specifically asked you guys to chime in, it sounded like it was a home run for you guys too. And I just think the execution overall was flawless. I think it was fantastic. Knowing what was happening with Sarah and just seeing it play out live action, the emotion was just off the charts. So much more impactful, I feel like. Like... It was sad for me watching it in the video game. It was like, I couldn't compare to like a real person. And I, so. think, I think a lot of that has to do with, if the performances didn't land, it wouldn't have been that emotional. It wouldn't have I, yeah, done anything I for think me. the performers did an absolutely amazing job, specifically Sarah in that moment, and Joel too. Obviously just the desperation and just the fear of what was playing out. I thought it was just absolutely perfect. Yeah, I felt it. I mean, it was just so good. So obviously we've met Joel, we've met Ellie. Yeah. They are now together, we are in Boston, and we're on a mission to get her to the Fireflies. And we've got Tess with us as well. And it was revealed that Ellie does have a bite that lasted very long time, and clearly Three there's weeks. something playing Three off weeks. there. So the story is building. We're obviously not gonna reveal anything in terms of the story because we're gonna keep this. There were a lot of comments asking about it. We're gonna keep this as spoiler free as possible we're gonna do our best and i think we're just not gonna some people asked for us to do like something at the very end yeah like a snippet of it i don't know if we'll do that right now we'll we'll see if the demand keeps jumping i mean it's something that we would have to do a little bit more research to go frame by frame and scene by scene because we played the game a long time ago and that memory like the overarching story is there yeah but like some of the fine details won't be there oh, so. right like yeah but overall, I, I think the writing, the acting, the performances, the visuals, so good. Everything lands. Everything is awesome. And I just can't wait to see where this goes because, again, they've already proven to add new things to it and add twists to it for the television show. Yeah. And, yeah, I mean, just the way that first moment hit. I just can't wait to see how other things play out and how other things hit emotionally and all that good stuff. Because, again, I thought it was a flawless start. I even said that it was my all-time favorite game adaptation after one episode. And I think I'm sticking to that just because of how much I loved it, how great it was. And I've had, I mean, I'm a huge Resident Evil fan. And obviously that never landed in terms of shows. Right. And there's a whole bunch of other pieces of content that... As a gamer, you'd love to see it play out. And just, there haven't been a lot of things that have hit. And, you know, this first episode hit harder and better and just nailed everything than anything else I've seen in terms of a game adaptation. Because we watched The Witcher before we ever played the game. Right. So, like, that's not really something that we have game knowledge of as we're watching the show. So, this, having the extensive, well, having the knowledge of the game and then watching the show... I thought it was absolutely fantastic, and I thought it was an excellent ex experience, even kind of knowing some of the big points, because, again, they were able to weave in some new and original things. So. Yeah. I'm still waiting for a Firewatch game adaptation. That would be great. I would watch that all day. You ready for episode two of The Last of Us? Yes. Let's go. Indonesia. Uh oh. What did you do? Apakah saya ada perbuat suatu kesalahan? Tidak. Tentu saja tidak. Apa bapak tidak salah orang? Andre Buratna, profesor mikologi Universitas Indonesia. Oh. Kami butuh bantuan Buratna untuk meneliti spesimen yang telah kami persiapkan. Ibu mungkin mau ah, mendapat berat yang sebutuh. Ini opio kordiset. Tapi kenapa menggunakan klorazol untuk mempersiapkan selain? Kami gunakan sebagai persiapan pengambilan sampel dari tubuh manusia, Bu Ratna. Kordiset tidak bisa bertahan pada manusia. Oh god. This is cool. 
I really like this. I do too. <laughs> oh shit. This feels like a scene from the movie Alien. <laughs> oh shit. I think that's probably the moment I would be like, I'm out. I gotta go. I don't I don't wanna research this anymore. Am I about to get a jump scare right now? What are you pulling out? Oh <sighs> shit. That's nasty, dude. Oh shit. Jadi kapan ini terjadinya? Kurang lebih 30 jam yang lalu. Di mana? Di pabrik tepung dan gabah di barat kota. Lahan yang sempurna untuk itu. Oh god. Seorang perempuan yang tiba-tiba melakukan kekerasan menyerang empat orang rekan kerja dan jadi tiga orang di antara. Mereka kemudian mengunci perempuan itu di kamar mandi sampai kemudian polisi datang. Perempuan itu mencoba menyerang dan terpaksa harus ditembak. I'm loving this language. This sounds. I mean, I know they're saying scary things, but this sounds so soothing. Di bawah untuk diobservas. Sayangnya beberapa jam kemudian telah menjadi keharusan sesuai dengan prosedur. Mereka harus tetap di asokus. Oh my god. Oh my god. Apa yang menggigit perempuan itu, Pak? Kami tidak tahu. Oh shit. How many people do they have to execute? Berkeliaran di luar sana. Lalu pekerja yang lain bagaimana? Empat belas orang hilang. Oh shit. Kami membawa ibu Ratna kemari untuk membantu kami untuk mencegah penyebaran. It's too late, isn't it? That's what it sounds like. I mean, obviously. Saya telah menghabiskan waktu hidup saya untuk mempelajari hal ini. Tidak ada obat. Oh God. Dan tidak ada vaksin. Jadi apa yang harus kami lakukan? Bom. Oh my God. Mulailah pengoboman. Bom seluruh kota. Dan seluruh orang yang lain. Holy shit. He's horrified. She's horrified. I mean, how hard is it for her to deliver that kind of like suggestion? Saya hanya ingin bersama dengan keluarga. Makan suami dan anak-anak saya. Oh my god. I... Absolutely love that we're getting essentially like origin story of how this all started. That was that was really good. I loved what they gave us in that first episode with the interview, this one, and basically the fact that because the one who bit her is out there, bomb the city. Before it spreads anywhere else. And this said 2003. I cannot remember what the first episode year said now. It's it's all a blur. But this is so good so far. Yeah. The production value of everything makes it feel it's, so real. Yes. Yes. Perfect. Oh shit. Morning. Show us your arm. Yeah, it's not getting any worse, is it? What was Marlene doing with an infected kid? I'm not infected. She found me after I was bitten. And she didn't shoot you? Clearly not. <laughs> You've locked me up and had her guys test me every day to see if I was getting sick. The environment is awesome. Yes, it's like perfect. There's not gonna be anything bad in here? Just you. <laughs> Fucking jaw, <laughs> man. <laughs> Scary. You know, you don't want to be around somebody who's infected and... Yeah, like, you can't process the idea that she's been bitten and she's not turning. She made it through the fucking night. It doesn't matter. It's gonna happen sooner or later. 
Oh, so Tess believes in Joel, doesn't right, at this we're point. We're still close to the wall. We sneak her back into the QZ. We find a different way to get the battery. This is our best shot. We take her back to the QZ. Someone's going to notice her arm. They're going to scan her, and they'll kill her. Well, better them than us. We need to stop talking about this kid like she's got some kind of life in front of her. Ouch. You hungry? You can share some of ours. Marlene sent me with my own. Is it chicken? Yeah, Marlene said they get it from smugglers. Guess not you guys. They're sitting here gnawing on this beef jerky. Hard -ass yeah. beef jerky <laughs> and she's got this chicken sandwich. <laughs> so important to Marlene. Don't lie to me. Or we'll take you back. Take me back, you don't get your battery. You heard that? Then you must have heard that he wants to shoot you. There's a Firefly base camp somewhere else with doctors. They're working on a cure. And whatever happened to me is it's the key, the key to, to find. finding the vaccine. That's what this is. None of it works ever. Fuck you, man. I didn't ask for this. You and me both. This isn't going to end well, Tess. We need to go back. It doesn't matter if she is or she isn't what the Fireflies say. If they believe that she is, then we get what we want. She is such a good Ellie. If she so much as twitches. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't fuck around with that. <laughs> like, Ellie, stop! <laughs> Joel's got a itchy trigger finger right now. He's terrified. He's, he doesn't want... He's, he, you know, he wants to get to Tommy. I get it. Can I have a gun? Absolutely no. not. Okay, Jesus, fine. I'll just throw a fucking sandwich at them. <laughs> kind of like that spot, though. It's really pretty with the... Outside growing inside until you open the door. Oh my wow. god. That looks great. That's fucking horrifying. It is. Like, what's keeping the middle of that building attached? Mm -hmm. <laughs> How's it just not collapsing in? Holy shit. It's like tragically beautiful. How to describe that? Is this where they bombed? They hit most of the big cities like this. They had to slow the spread somehow. Wow. It worked here, but it didn't in most places. That's so fucked. So the state house is across there. It's about a 10 minute walk if you could go straight. Long way or short way? It's the long way or the we're fucking dead way. Well, I vote long way just based on that limited information. Are they already? You'll we'll know it when they're close. You didn't know last time. How did you get bit? You know the old mall in the QZ? The one that's sealed off and boarded up and no one's supposed to go in ever? That one? I wanted to see what it was like. Didn't think there was going to be anything in there and then one just came at me out of nowhere. Thought I got away, but. So it was just you in there alone? Yeah. How old are you? 14. Wow. You got some balls on you, sister. Thanks. Everyone said the open city was crazy. Like swarms of infected running around everywhere. Not exactly like that. You know, people like to tell stories. So there aren't super infected that explode fungus spores on you? Shit, I hope not. The head bob is a lot for me right now. The the movement of the camera. Yeah. It, I mean, it feels more real, but like it also, it's like I can't even focus. Oh, there's an infected. Oh my god! What a Look shot! Look at that. What was that? Let's keep moving. They filmed this. I always like all these apocalypse style shows and movies and stuff. The just parking lot of just destroyed parked cars is just always such a powerful moment. Just like just shows how just shut down everything is. Like how this is uh, awesome. It, nothing looks fake. Nothing looks like CGI. Nothing looks this looks green like a practical screen. set. This looks this is legit. a practical set. Yeah. You ever stay in a place like this? Uh, I know a little out of our league. I don't even know what this is. Have you heard of books? Wait, are we going in there? Yeah, we gotta get to the stairwell on the other side. Well, I, I don't know how to swim. Seriously? Can we have pools in the QZ? No, smart ass. <laughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to know that. <laughs> Ugh, that would be... Yuck. I feel like it would be slimy and you'd slip. That's a terrible idea. Yeah. Like me shaping luggage. 
Yes, ma'am. Right away, ma'am. You're I'm... a weird kid. You're a weird kid. <laughs> oh, God. Shit. I'm sorry. You okay? Yep. Fucking fact. You know, they're not doing a great job of looting things. You're supposed to, like, loot stuff and, like... Open empty drawers. Like, hello? I remember all the empty drawers. That is so scary. Are you kidding me? Good up there? Yeah, it's a bit of a mess, so I'm gonna need a few minutes. Girl? <laughs> nice knife. Where'd you learn to do that? The circus. Teenagers. We so do. good. The dynamic is so good. I love the two of them. How long do infected live? Oh, I thought you went to school. It's a really shitty one. Well, some last about a month or two. But there's others. Been walking around for 20 years. Damn. You ever kill one? Yeah, I killed lots of them. Was it hard? Like, knowing they were people once? Sometimes. What about that guy last night? She knows. She knows. So there was the talk show at what was it the sixties, and then this happened in two thousand three, and then obviously Joel and Ellie are in twenty twenty three. I'm loving yeah, the, the Sarah green. scene happened probably not long after that. Yeah, I, I can't remember when the Sarah scene the was. Month. I can't remember that year. That year. The I think month. it was the same year. It was just different months, I think. Well, it's been quite a few years since 20. now, right? It was a 20-year time jump. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> wow. <gasps> oh, God. There's so many. The last time we were here, they were still deep inside the buildings. Then I guess enough people came through looking for the QZ. We went inside seeking shelter. And that's how they get more and more of the city, bit by bit, year after year. Holy shit. Do you look like maggots? Doesn't it look like maggots writhing around? Oh, they did a really good job with this. They're connected. More than you know, the fungus also grows underground. Long fibers like wires, some of them stretching over a mile. You step on a patch of cordyceps in one place, and you can wake a dozen infected from somewhere else. That's crazy. You're not immune from being ripped apart. It's important. I'm trying to keep you alive. Ugh. So we're not going that way? No. What do we do then? Short way? Museum. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Do we have masks? Is it dead? It's bone dry. It could mean they're all finally dead in there. Wow. Like you touched it with your hand. We're gonna go slowly. If we come up against anything, we get behind us and we stay there, okay? Yes. Oh, shit. <laughs> Dude, going into these buildings would be fucking horrifying. I mean, for as terrifying as this stuff is, it's very pretty when it grows along the wall. Dude. Oh, God. Oh, shit. That looks fresh. What the fuck did that? Maybe he was attacked outside and crawled through the doors. Who would you hear? Are you saying an attempted did that? I've been attacked by one and it wasn't like that. Okay, from this point forward, we are silent. They're doing a phenomenal job of building the tension. Mm-hmm. <sighs> oh, shit. This has got to be the creakiest stairs of life at this point. Mm, bitch. It's old. It's been rotten. 
it's worn down. It's got all that shit growing inside it. Like, I don't, like, it's oh, impossible to stay quiet. There's a hand. That was a hand. Oh, oh God. Shit. Sorry. That was loud. Sorry. Sorry. Everybody. Shh. 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 He's like, for reals? Where else are you supposed to step? Honestly, honestly, honestly. Oh god, dust falling from the sky. That means something's moving upstairs or the building. Fuck no. Oh god, they did good. Oh, that's so gross. Fuck that. I could turn up the volume for this one. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, this my is God. so good. Oh, do we get to see him up close? The, the movement. Oh, God. So good. God, they all oh, those look amazing. Oh, shit, dude. Hell yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Wow, dude. Those look real as fuck. Creeps me the hell out that, like, you can shine a light right on them and they can't see shit. <laughs> Fucker, dude. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh fuck. Uh, no! 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 That is so nasty. <sighs> so Shoot nasty. Shoot him in the head! Damn, girl. That doesn't matter, apparently. Couple headshots, couple headshots. Dude, this is so good. Clearly, Ellie, we haven't told you everything what about what's happening. Parents, so... <laughs> you fucking kidding me? I mean, if it was gonna happen to one of us. Let's get the fuck out of here. Good idea. That was so good. They look perfect. They, the movement is perfect. The, the sounds, sounds, the movements, the look, everything. Fantastic job. What about the kid? You mean the first bite didn't take? Or what about the second? I'd like you just take the good news. Can you do that? Make to think for once maybe we could actually win. That scares the living shit out of me. A fucking ladder with some wood. Hell no. Nah. Yeah. Is it everything you hoped for? Jerry's still out. But man, you can't deny that view. Yeah, it's a the, beautiful view. The golden roof. I love the music too. It's me so too. good. Mm 
Wow. I don't know. Uh -uh. They went inside. Come on. Yes. Come on. Holy shit. Who killed them? Fedra? No. One of them got bit. The healthy ones fought the sick ones. Everyone lost. Dude, that was nasty. Where did Marlene say that she was taking you? I, I don't know. Just west. Just west. One of them's got to have a map on them. It's over. We are going home. This is not my fucking home! I'm staying. Our luck had to run out sooner or later. Fuck. She's infected. Show me. This is real. Josh is fucking real. I need you to get her to Bill and Frank's. No. They'll take her off your hands. No. They'll handle it from here. No, no, no. I can't. They yeah. won't take her. They're they not going to take they her. They will because you'll convince them. <sighs> Ask you for anything. Not to feel the way I felt. No. Not to let you shut the fuck up because I don't have time. This is your chance. You get her there. You keep her alive. And you set everything right. Oh my god, that's so gross. That's so crazy. I love how they did that. So now they're all coming. They know exactly where they are. What are you doing? Making sure that they don't follow you. Say who you can say. No! We're not leaving her! Oh shit. shot right there. Whew. Wow. So again, I'm not going to go into any spoilers or any specifics, but the reason why this is working so well is because they're changing certain aspects of the story. Right. They're changing certain things that are, you guys can go look them up if you want, but we're not going to reveal them yet, at least not on this video, but they're doing enough stuff they're adding enough new elements and kind of 
I think the way that played out at the end was so good. So good. You felt the emotion. I love the way that they kind of teased the whole idea that they, like, threw the spores or whatever those are called, that they could communicate with each other and they're connected so far apart. Yeah, like, yes. Uh And so the fact that Joel killed one and then it was, like, wrapping around his finger, it sent a message to all the others and they came running and holy shit. I do love that aspect. So well done. All the fibers and the... Oh, that's so gross! Nastiest kiss of all time? (sighs) Yeah. Holy... That was so gross. Worst (sighs) French kiss ever! I'm so impressed so far with these first two episodes. Yeah. I mean, again, just going to keep talking about the delivery by the performers. They are absolutely killing it. I think Tess, Joel, Ellie, I think they're all doing a phenomenal job. Obviously, Marlene in the first episode... I mean, all of it is just so good. The visuals, I am so blown away by the sets and just the overall environment that they're filming in. It looks so good and it just hits so hard with what we're watching in terms of the environment, the world they're in now. And I just think it's absolutely fantastic. Agreed. I mean, the super infected, as they're calling them, I thought... They looked incredible. They sounded incredible. Their movements were like perfect. Right on. Oh my God. I just, that was one of the things that I was wondering how it was going to translate into live action. Yeah. Is like, because that totally looks like and feels like something that could look kind of cheesy and off, but it works. Again, I want to hear from those who haven't played the game. What did you think of the super infected? What did you think about their movements and their sounds? Did it work for you guys? Leave the comments below, obviously. But I just love, love the story they're telling. I love the additions that they're making. The stuff at the beginning of the episode where we're really kind of getting origin story of the infection, I think is so cool. And the professor or whoever doing the examination, the fact that she came to the conclusion of like, bomb it. Like, that's just such a horrifying thought process. And you know she didn't want to say it. You know that's not what she wanted she to say. She was like shaking and she yeah. was like putting out her teacup and it's like, I I don't want to say this, but this needs to happen in order to stop the spread, in order to stop mass yeah. death. Because you didn't have the original. You couldn't find the original person who bit the victim that she was checking out. And the fact that that one was still at large, it's like, yeah, we probably got a really big problem on our hands. The, just the fibers, the fibery fingers oh my god that just creeps me the hell out so good the visuals i though i think that's like the biggest takeaway from this episode i think episode one was about like the delivery of the performers and the actors this one was the environment yeah the visuals definitely, of the infected definitely more of an emotional connection to, to start off with so that you're connected to the characters oh, yes now here the story begins yeah so I, I thought that was another absolute banger of an episode i cannot wait to see where this keeps going and what they keep giving us because through two episodes i think it's been fucking awesome same any other thoughts no all right y'all leave your comments and we'll see you guys later for the next one have a good one bye